That is the Raquel Welch 16 inch topper in the Transformation Collection. See how really quickly this topper goes on. So what I had meant to do was to take a good amount of my hair because I'm going to pull it out and I'll take about, oh, maybe an inch or so. My hair is still a little bit wet, but that's what I'm going to take out. So just pull some of your own hair out if you have hair. Usually people who wear toppers do have hair. And just kind of let that stay like that. And I'll put a little clip on it to hold it. And then you're going to take out a little bit. I'm going to put a little bit of it stays. If you don't have it stays, one of my favorite tools. Um, and you don't necessarily even need it with this. It just makes me feel more secure. I'm just going to put that right there, just a little bit. How do you get it off? You just take a washcloth, moisten it to almost till it's dripping wet, and then just rub it over the hair and rinse it out and rub it again, rinse out the cloth and rub it again, and then comb it and then dry it. And I'll tell you, it, it puts a little bit of body into your hair too. It's pretty cool stuff. Just get that going on your on your hand and then just a tiny bit just a teeny tiny bit so that the wig or that so that the topper doesn't start to ride back and then you want to wait just a few seconds maybe 30 seconds maybe a minute depending upon I'm going to get it off my hand depending upon how humid it is it's not humid in, in my room at all And then you're going to grab your topper and she's going to be put on with the front. You're holding the front of the topper. Topper's facing the ceiling. Make sure all the combs are open. Make sure all the hair is pulled out of the combs so you don't have any hair stuck in the combs, which you generally will have after you've worn it once. Okay, and then the it stays is tacky and then you're just gonna find the spot where you want to put her now this this uh, topper is split right down the middle naturally so I don't usually put put it there but I'm gonna kind of put it just behind my widow's peak and then press and I'm just going to hold it there 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 Press, 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 press. Keep pressing, keep pressing. And while it's drying, now I'm going to take the combs, which are open, and secure them to my bio hair. So I'm doing that now. So if you rewind this uh, video and take it right from where I, I put the It Stays on, you can see, really, it doesn't take a long time to put a topper on. It really doesn't, once you get the hang of it. So I've got one, two, three, I think and all the combs, I've got to take this clip out. All the combs, I believe, except one in the back, are closed. Make sure all your combs are closed, and they are. And then, remember I had those clips in the front. And take those out. One, two. Hello. And then let's make sure it's not going anywhere. It's pretty secure. And now you're going to take your wig comb and just pull that hair right over. however you want it. I like it like that. That's how I like it. 
And I think I even pulled it back a, a little bit further than I normally do. You know, you be the judge. It's kind of hard to do when you're on the on the video because you can't really get close up to your mirror like you normally would. But that's all there is to it. When you're combing, make sure you comb from the bottom up. So you don't want to stretch those fibers or break those fibers. And of course, make sure you're using a good comb. And so there you see my bio hair so that when the wind blows, right? Now you could even pull this behind your ear for more believability. And that's it. That's all there is to it. Let me give do the spin for you now that she's all combed out. And uh, it would pretty much stay like that. I could always hit it with some hairspray. I'm sure later on when the kids come, I'll pick it up and put it on top of my head. And that'll be that. So now where is my mirror? Okay. It's pretty, right? It's got good coverage. And so you can see right at the right at the right at the top there. Hard to tell. Am I right? Very hard to tell. And then if I didn't want to hit it with hairspray, you know, I could take one of these teeny tiny little clips and just kind of work that in right there and grab it. So that's basically it. That is the Raquel Welch 16 inch topper in the Transformation Collection 5660, also known as Silver. Thanks so much for watching. If you like, give it a like. Hit the little bell icon so you don't miss any of my upcoming videos. I will often go live impromptu. Bye, everybody.